Drag a toothpick onto the workstation. Drag a clean glass slide onto the workstation. Drag the wash bottle onto the workstation. Drag the needle onto the workstation. Put a drop of water on the slide from the wash bottle. Fill the mouth with lukewarm water kept in the glass. Rinse the mouth once and spit the water in the basin. Pick up the toothpick from the table. From the blunt end of toothpick, gently scrape the inner surface of the cheek. Transfer the scrapings on the drop of water kept in the center of the glass slide. Click on the needle to spread out the scraping and separate the clumped areas. Drag the bottle of methylene blue stain onto the workstation. Drag the dropper onto the workstation. Drag a blotting paper onto the workstation. Click on the cursor to open the lid of the stain bottle. Fill the dropper with methylene blue stain. Add a drop of methylene blue stain on the scraping kept on the slide. Remove the extra stain using the edges of the blotting paper. Drag the bottle of glycerine onto the workstation. Drag a cover slip onto the workstation. Drag a needle onto the workstation. Click on the dropper of the glycerine bottle to fill it. Put a drop of glycerine on the stained scrapings kept on the slide. Click on the needle to take it to the slide. Place the cover slip carefully with the help of needle to avoid the entry of air bubbles. Tap gently from the blunt end of the needle to spread the scrapings evenly beneath the cover slip. Drag a blotting paper onto the workstation. Remove excess of glycerin from the edges of the cover slip using a blotting paper. Drag the microscope on the workstation. Place the mounted slide on the stage of microscope. Observe the slide under 10 times magnification of the microscope. Change the focus of the microscope using the coarse adjustment knob to view the cells. Look for an area with evenly spread out cells. Move the slide kept on the stage of the microscope using the stage adjustment knob. Observe the new area under 10 times magnification. Use the course adjustment knob to view the clear structure of the cells. Revolve the objective lens nose piece to change the objective lens to 40 times magnification. Observe the magnified view of cells on 40 times magnification. Adjust the focus of the microscope using the coarse adjustment knob to clearly view the cheek cells.
adjust the focus of the microscope using the fine adjustment knob to view the clear structure of cheek cells.